Hello everyone, welcome back. Want this trending smooth whip slide effect? Okay let's go, be ready with your clips in After Effects. Double click the layer to open separate window for that, and now select Roto Brush Tool. Start selecting our car, do this perfectly, to remove extra part press and hold Alt key on keyboard. After selecting car go frame by frame, make correction if there are some outlines. To go frame by frame forward use page down key on keyboard and to go back each frame use page up key. After you see this green lines in whole clip, click on freeze frames. It will take time according to your PC specifications. After completing masking you will see only selected area. In this you see only car and background is removed. Ok now duplicate the clip two times using Ctrl plus D on keyboard. And simply removed roto brush effect from bottom layer. Now go to effects panel and add offset effect to middle layer. Go at beginning of the clip and give keyframe to shift center. And at end of the clip give value to Y axis as I am doing, just follow me. Slide effect is ready but we are making it more realistic. For that we are adding, direction blur effect to middle layer. Set direction 90 degree and blur value 10 or 15. Now add glow effect, add glow as you required in your video. And that's it, car smooth slide whip effect is ready. Now we are doing the same but now with characters, this may be very useful when you're making AMV edits. Double click the layer, start roto brushing as we done in first clip. Go frame by frame, make correction if any, and after seeing green line, freeze the frames. Ok now duplicate the clip two times using Ctrl plus D on keyboard. And simply removed roto brush effect from bottom layer. Add offset effect and set keyframes as we done in earlier clip. If you want slide effect, upside down then change the value of X axis, but we are doing the same as first clip. Add the keyframes at start and end of the clip, change the value of Y axis, and that's it no any rocket science. After that add directional blur and glow effect to the middle layer, it will give more smooth look to slide effect, you can also edit speed graph in graph editor but I am not showing that it is not needed here. Ok friends, that's all for today. Hope you love this effects and like the way I am teaching you, do not forget to like, share, subscribe the channel, and share with you editor friends, and start using this effect in your edits.